Hi friends, today we will see how we can interconvert molality with the mole fraction and also molality with the mass fraction. Okay, for that we will take two problems. One, molality of a urea solution is in water is 2. Then what is urea's mole fraction here? We start from the known equation that is m is equal to number of molar solute by mass of solvent into 1000. Okay, here we can take mole fractions to be the number of moles itself. When the total amount is 1 mole, mole fraction and mole are same. So we can in the place of nb we can use xb. But denominator we want mass of solvent. Okay, xa is the number of mole of solute to solvent here into its molecular mass gives you the mass. So NB is replaced by XB and the WA that is the mass of the medium is replaced by XA into WMA. So now you got the relation between molality and the mole fraction. You can use this equation both to convert molality to mole fraction or mole fraction to molality. Very simple. Easy to remember also. Now we are going to substitute 2 is equal to xb divided by 1 minus xb into 1000 by mass of solvent 18 being water. Substitute 0 0.036 uh, after cross multiplying 2 into 18 by 1000 0 0.03660 xb by 1 minus xb. Rearrange isolate xb you get it as 0 0.035 that's the mole fraction. So the only thing is that you have to make this by heart. Now we go to the other section. Mass fraction of urea in its ethanol solution is 0 0.5, 0 0.4, find its a molality. Start from what we know. Molality is equal to number of molar solute by mass of solvent into 1000. See here instead of Nb, we can use mu b, mu b is mass fraction by molecular mass. So Nb can be replaced by mu b by wmb, mass by molecular mass. Any mass can be taken, so we take mass fraction itself as the mass. Mu B by WMB stands for NB, and in the place of WA, you can directly use mu A. So here we are using masses for mass fraction, or got that? Instead of mass, you are using the mass fraction. So it comes like this. So after rearranging, you get M is equal to mu B by mu A into 1000 by WMB. Why? Uh, see, compare these two, very easy to compare and remember. Here it is xb by xa, here it is mu b by mu a. 1000, 1000. The main difference, here it is the molecular mass of the solvent, whereas here it is the molecular mass of the solute. So, while you make by heart, keep this in mind that in this equation, it is molecular mass of solvent that comes in the equation, whereas in this equation, it is the molecular mass of the solute that comes in the equation. While, while we explained, we understood why it comes like that. Why it is molecular mass of solvent here and why it is molecular mass of solute here. Through the explanation, we understood. Okay, now we directly substitute. Here, 0 0.4 by 0 0.6 because mu b is mu b divided by 1 minus mu b, that is mu a. For a 0 0.4 by 0 0.6 into 1000 by molecular mass of solute, the solvent is ethanol, but its molecular mass doesn't come in that picture. 60 is the molecular mass of the solute, then you get 11.11 molar. So, this conversion has come several times even in the previous exams. Okay, entrance exams, I mean. Okay. 